Hey guys, it's Becky from Bama, and today we're going to be talking about New Year's resolutions. Now, I know a lot of people hate New Year's resolutions, and they say, why would you make a resolution when you can just do whatever it is you want to do and just call it something else? I don't know. People, I get a lot of hate when I talk about New Year's resolutions. But my reasoning is that I've always made them, and they've really worked out well for me. I've always been one of those people that has believed if you fail to plan, then you're planning to fail. So these are kind of like my goals for the year. If you want to call them goals and that makes you feel more comfortable, we'll call them that. But I have come up with 10 and I'm not going to go through the whole list, but I'm just going to give you a few of them just to give you an idea of the kind of stuff I'm trying to achieve in 2017. And the first one is to read the 90 day Bible. Now I've done the one year Bible plan on the YouVersion Bible app, which I highly suggest. It's awesome, but sometimes it's easy to not really dig into what you're reading because you get an Old Testament passage, a New Testament passage, a psalm and a proverb, and so it's kind of really short passages, whereas with this, you're just working straight from Genesis to Revelation, and so I kind of think that's cool because I'm really going to be digging into each book one at a time, so that's one of my goals for this year. Another one is to prioritize date night. We have five children. We don't get a lot of date night. And so right now, our early goal is just once a month. Just once a month, just a time for me and this handsome guy right here. It's not going to focus on him, but you can see him. There he is. Me and this handsome guy right here to have date night together without any kiddos, without a three-year-old that wants to throw food or without the four older siblings who want to fight with each other while we're trying to enjoy dinner. No. Mom and Daddy need a date night. And so some of the others are kind of fitness related. For those of you that don't know, I'm actually a fitness instructor. I teach ReFit. I used to be a Zumba instructor and I switched over to ReFit. ReFitRev.com if you want to check it out. It's a pretty awesome program. But I want to build my ReFit class. I want to get certified as a group exercise instructor and I would like to hit my ideal weight. Now, I am only about five pounds from my ideal weight right now, so a lot of people think that that's kind of cheesy, but those last five pounds, if you've ever had five pounds to lose, those last five pounds feel almost impossible, and so I would really like to get those gone and increase my flexibility. I've never been a flexible person. Even when I was in high school and I was thin and young, I was never the person that could just put my feet out like this and lay my face on the ground. And I would like to maybe not reach that level because I realize that I'm in my 40s and so that may not happen, but I would at least like to get more flexible. So that's one of my others. And I'd like to run another 5K. I ran my first 5K in 2016 on Thanksgiving morning. I did a turkey trot in Gardendale and it was so fun. It was a trail run. So there was a lot of uphill, downhill rocks. I mean, it was kind of like a hiking trail, but we did a 5K on it. My time was not that great. I did it in like 55, 56 minutes, something like that. So it was almost an hour, but it was kind of like a single lane trail where there wasn't a lot of passing and it was kind of hilly and stuff. But even if it had been like on a flat track, I probably wouldn't have done a way better time than that because I've not ever really been a runner. I'm more of a cardio is my partio, but not really running. So I want to do another 5K in 2017. So I would love to do maybe a color run or something like that. Take you guys with me and make a video while we're there. That'd be fun. Okay, another one of mine that I'm really excited about this year is Gishwas. If you've watched my channel trailer and you have learned a little bit about Gishwas or if you are here on my page because you are a Gishwas participant and you found out that I was and that brought you here, then you're going to understand when I say that Gishwa's domination is one of my goals for this year. One of my resolutions, if you will, is to lead Team Red Shirts, go Team Red Shirts, to Gishwa's domination. And if that's winning, that's awesome because I would love to win and go on a big vacation with Misha Collins. But if that is just doing everything with excellence and to the best of our ability, I'm happy with that too. I just want to do really well this year and do our best. We have such a great team. Our team is so talented. We have some really creative people. So I would just love to see us do really well this year. And it's really fun. I'll be posting tons of videos during Gishwas where you can get a behind the scenes look at some of the crazy stuff that we're doing. So that'll be fun. And then another one I had is I work um, with an organization 
through my church called the Birmingham Dream Center, where we go out into areas of Birmingham, Alabama, that are very poverty stricken and we take meals, we pray with people, we build relationships, we help people find jobs, get insurance, get medical care. And so I'm actually going to be a leading a team in one of the neighborhoods this year and I'm very excited about it. So one of my goals is just to do a great job there and make tons of relationships and see a bunch of lives change. So we'll be making some videos from that too. And then my last resolution for this year was to start a YouTube channel for vlogging because I have another channel and it's just videos of like my family opening Christmas presents, things that only people that know me personally or that are related to me would even care to see and some of those people wouldn't even care to see a lot of those videos, but it has 409 subscribers. So I'm hoping that some of those people will come over to this channel and we can grow this channel because I would really love my short term goal right now is 100 subscribers so that I can get a custom URL. But I'd really love to see this just grow into something awesome where we can have this nerd community that we can hang out with and that would be fun. So my big resolution for YouTube was to start vlogging on a channel just dedicated to nerd culture, random acts of kindness and the nerdiness of my family. So you have found it. So now I would like to get some of my kiddos. One of our segments on this channel is going to be actually called Ask a Kiddo, where we ask my kids different questions. And so today I'm going to call them in here and we're going to ask them what their New Year's resolution is because mommy told them to make a New Year's resolution even if it's just one, so we're gonna see what theirs are. Okay, this is my oldest kiddo. Tell them your name. Christian. This is Christian. So Christian, what is your New Year's resolution for this year? To read the whole Bible. I think that's an awesome one. Thanks, buddy. Okay, this is my exact middle child. There's five, so we have an exact middle child, and this is him. Can you please tell the people your name? My name is Malik Johnson. And what is your New Year's resolution? To drink water for the whole um, 2017. You're going to be healthy? Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Good job, buddy. <laughs> this is my youngest daughter. Tell them what your name is. Kaden. What is your New Year's resolution? My New Year's resolution is to, do, is to learn how to do a back handspring. You can do it. I believe in you. This is my oldest daughter and second oldest child. Please tell them your name. Lucy. And what is your New Year's resolution this year? My New Year's resolution is to cook better food and eat healthier. I think that's awesome. We could all stand to be healthier. And hey, since we've got him here, oh, this is my youngest. Yay. What is your name? Lesson. Brooks, right? And what do you want to do in 2017? Um, I want to do... I want to play football. You want to play football? Mm -hmm. I think that's a good goal. Can I have a sugar? Mm. Say bye-bye, people. Bye-bye, people. Bye-bye. So that's our family's New Year's resolutions. I would love to hear what yours are. If you would, please put down what your top resolution is down in the comments, and I look forward to reading them. Maybe I'll get some ideas and add some to my own. Thanks, guys. See you soon. Your illusion is to learn how to do a backhand.